Hey there, we are at the Goodwill in Pasadena on Fair Oaks and I wanna just pop in to see what I could find today and I'm very, very happy with what I have found. So we're gonna start with the best thing. So these are um, Stuart Weitzman suede boots in this style. This over the knee style is $950 at Neiman Marcus. And um, they're not 50 50 boots, they're all suede boots. And they're $30 here. Because um, I have a 20% off coupon, it makes them $24. And they're selling on Real Real for the price of around $375 or so. So that is amazing. Amazing, um, amazing condition. And just amazing. So what can I say? That is the find of the day. Next, we have this super cute um, official licensed Rolling Stone Kids t-shirt, which is so cute with the sequins. And this is my aesthetic. It's $4. And, um, you know, with the coupon, it'll be 80 cents off. <laughs> so it'll be $3.20. It's just adorable. So um, it is officially licensed. It's by Next. And I think Next is a UK store, if I'm remembering from my time there um so yeah loving that this is wonderful all of these polo and then polo ralph lauren vintage sweaters do really well this one's cotton uh the wool ones are just do amazing but this is 100 percent cotton perfect collectors look for these um they sell for hundreds of dollars so if you've never really focused on those definitely focus on ralph lauren for the wool and cotton ones, it's eight ninety nine, and uh, so it's nine dollars, so it be almost two dollars off. So that is a winner. Very happy about that. This I'm on the fence about, but this kind of thing, these bustiers always sell at the antique mall, um, lavish. They're not super expensive or anything. It'd be around ten dollars after the coupon. Um, but a lot of the girls who like that goth look really like this and um, it's a nice color it's not black and uh, a little steampunk thing going on here this is a size medium I did not get a chance to look this up before I got on here but I really like that so these are things that I'm definitely not getting I'm just showing for the good of the cause this is free people but there's nothing exciting about it it's super conservative dress and people's lifestyle has really changed um, it's $13, so I'm not spending $13 on that. But if it were the bins, sure, I'd pick it up. But $13 on a free people dress that might be hard to sell at any price, given the, you know, the fitted nature, the conservative style. I think it's super tough. So that's staying behind. And this I just pulled because collaborations do sell. This one, um... It's $13 and nobody's looking for this. If you could sell it for $13 or sell it at all, you'd be lucky. But this particular Target collaboration is not highly sought after, at least this piece. So I'm leaving it behind. If it was at the bins, sure, because it's really lightweight poly. Maybe it'd be 50 cents. You could take it to maybe a you know crossroads, see if they'd buy it. This Miranda Kerr, I guess she's an actress. I thought this cute blouse. Little polka dot blouse was cute but I'm not gonna get it because um, polka dot always sells but for seven dollars I'm just not moved by it I believe it behind just don't need it don't need it um, if it was any if some sort of brand I would that wasn't a celebrity brand but nobody's looking for that just like nobody's looking for Jacqueline Smith this, um, if it with the bins I would get, mine is too much for what it is, but this kind of white ruffly blouse sells, sells and sells again at the Vintage Mall. I just wanted to show that to you. And that's it. That's all we wrote. So this is my pile. We'll look this up, but yeah, so I'm really happy with what's in here. The only thing I really don't need is this t-shirt, um, so I may leave this behind. I am in the middle of putting a thread up box together so I will see if that's something that they're selling but Rolling Stone stuff always sells so I kind of like having it in my Poshmark store and that's it thousand dollar boots
by Stuart Weitzman. We have a Bintu triathlon sweater. This I don't need. And this I don't need. But we'll see what it ends up in the end. So that's it. Thank you for joining me. Oh, polka dots over here. Thank you for joining me. Um, and uh, pretty little things. Let me tell you, I can barely sell this stuff. Pretty little things. There's no money in it. Um, anyway, it is something you could sell at a crossroads, so you'd have to pick it up the bins, but it's not a sidebar. If you haven't subscribed, please do. If you hit the notification button, you can know when I'm putting up a new video or going live. And we have lots of fun stuff coming up. Um, Brenda Cooper is going to be back with me, and we're going to be together here first here at the Pickwick, Pickwick Vintage Show. So we'll be doing things from there, so be sure to subscribe and get notified when we do that. Thank you for joining me.